workforce shortages and their impacts. We cover how the shortage is affecting you and what people are doing to help. Today, we're starting the series with where your food starts on the farm. Right now, the farms and dairies across Idaho cannot find enough foreign workers nor domestic workers. The Idaho Dairymen's Association says that's despite Idaho dairies offering about 15 bucks an hour as the starting wage for an entry level job with no experience required. The CEO of the Idaho Dairymen's Association says labor is the second largest cost of production in the dairy industry and the number one cost for all other agricultural industries. So as ag employers keep jacking up their wages to try to attract workers, it's eliminating their profits and affecting the prices we're all paying for groceries. It's not all of the inflationary impact, but it is one of those factors where we're seeing food prices increase because we have a lack of supply and food supplies are starting to get tighter just because we don't have the labor to get the work done to get the food to market. And, and that's going to get, continue to get worse. E even if you see other things normalize in our economy, if we don't solve this labor piece, we're going to continue to see cost increases in the supermarket on food. The Farm Workforce Modernization Act would give dairies access to a federal seasonal work visa program for the first time in history. That bill has passed the U.S. House twice and is stalled in the Senate. Coming up tomorrow, we follow the workforce shortage from the farm to the table at your local restaurants.